Thousands are still without power across Louisville after devastating storms broke through our area yesterday. Take a look at these numbers on your screen. The latest numbers from lg and &E. More than 170,000 of their customers are without power, with more than 75,000 of those customers right here in Louisville. WHAS 11's Connor Steffen shows us how the Derby City is pulling together for recovery. After crews worked tirelessly throughout the morning hours now here into the evening, much of the storm's remnants remain here. You see things are still taped off. There's still trees and down roadways as well as power lines. And of course, there's still thousands without power here in Louisville. During a press conference Saturday morning, a spokesperson for lg &E said restoring power for all of Louisville customers will be a multi-day process. I'm kind of wondering, yeah, I don't expect them to be able to fix it like that. Victor Simon is one of nearly 80,000 lg &E users who were still without power by five Saturday evening. The utility company had 450 of its crews out in Jefferson County throughout the day assessing damage and repairing critical infrastructure. LG and E notes the last time a storm system brought this many power outages to the area was 2009. And taking a look at the damage residents in this Belknap neighborhood experienced, the significance becomes fairly clear. I just pray that they're safe and they have some place warm to go to, to be fed, taken care of. Um, and we'll get through it. Mayor Craig Greenberg said all major Louisville roadways should be open by the end of Saturday. In Louisville, Connor Steffen, WHAS 11, on your side.